All right, so here we are in the over app. We have our 4500 by 5400 dimensions for our merch by Amazon Design. And now we want to add some artwork to it. So you see down at the bottom, the first icon looks like a couple mountains here on a postcard. You press on that. Now, keep in mind, I am using Over Pro, so I have all the options along the bottom. So first it gives me photos, and then it gives me favorites. So those are going to be the favorites from your photos. Now, they also give you access to Unsplash and Pixabay. Okay, now both of these are searchable, and these are Creative Commons Zero licensing, meaning you can use them for anything you want. You can even download them and sell them if uh, you can get someone to pay you for Creative Commons Zero license images. Uh, and there's no attribution required. You can do whatever you want with these images with Unsplash and Pixabay. So say you're making a cat shirt. So let's see what we get with cat in Unsplash, you see all these images that come up. Some of these might be easy to use, some of them might require a little editing if they don't need a background. And you're going to do the same thing here in uh, Pixabay. And let's see what comes up. You see we have different images that come up. You may even see some similar images that come up on both. Now they do give you access to Google Images here, and I almost, I don't say wish they didn't, uh, but I don't want you guys to confuse Google Images with Unsplash and Pixabay because just because it's on Google Images doesn't necessarily mean that you are okay to use it or that you have rights to it. Uh, it may be that you could use it, uh, but I am not here to tell you if you can or cannot. Uh, I do like the fact that they put in, or uh, they're kind of sorting it by these transparent background uh, files that you, you would be able to use. You can certainly use these for your own uh, social media, non-commercial use images. Uh, but as it is now, um, I don't believe you can use Google Images with a guarantee that, uh, that you have commercial rights to them. So please just keep that in mind. And PNG on the end, it actually goes through and sorts any PNGs that you have in, uh, in your photos. It puts them in here, kind of make it easy to, to import. Uh, you might find that you end up using it that way. Uh, so that's really how to use it. Uh, you can import any of these images. You can zoom them in. If you wanted to make a shirt like this, now with all the black background, it may not look that good. Um, but you get the idea uh, of what you can do. And of course, you have all the editing tools down at the bottom uh, to adjust and do different size and shadow. Uh, the one thing I like about the size, of course, you can just pinch and zoom. You can twist this if you want. Um, but with the size and, uh, and rotation, you can really narrow it down. So you can plus, plus, plus. I mean, it's giving me half percent increments here as I go. So you can really nail down. They also have a nudge feature. Uh, so you can really get that image exactly where you want it. Maybe if doing it with your finger, moving it around isn't as accurate. Uh, so you want to kind of nudge it. And of course, it gives you these nice yellow lines. So you can be sure that your image is centered. Either centered right in the middle, or if you're putting it up near the top, you're still centered in the middle. That's what those yellow lines are for. And... Uh, yeah, that's how you use the uh, the images. So you can add as many as you want. You can have multiple layers. You can see up at the top, we only have one layer right now. But as you see, as we start adding text and using different fonts, that uh, there's going to be a lot of different things that you can do. Uh, but that's how you add images uh, through the Over app by using Unsplash, Pixabay, Google Images, and of course, your photos as well. The photo you've taken, of course, you're going to have rights to it. So simple, short video of how to add photos to your Merch by Amazon template in Over.